Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about declining balance depreciation as part of interest and depreciation. So what is declining balance depreciation? Well, this method is where we reduce the value of an asset each period by a constant percentage. And the formula is given there, where the salvage value equals the original value or initial value 1 minus r as a fraction all to the power of number of periods. So go on, write that formula down so we can use it moving forward. So let's do a few examples. So a car purchased for 112,600 depreciates at 12% per annum. Now remember, per annum means per year. Calculates its depreciation in the first year. Well, that's simple. We don't need to use the formula. It's just going to be 11,000 uh, sorry, 112,600 times 12%. And that's how much it depreciates in the first year. So what is the value of the car after the first year? Well, it's going to be its original value minus how much it depreciated. So we get 99,088. But when questions get a bit trickier, like C, what is the value of the car after five years to the nearest cent? We're going to have to use a formula where the salvage value equals the initial value, 112,600, times 1 minus the rate as a fraction, so 12% over 100, to the power of the number of periods, 5 years in this case, and we get our salvage value after 5 years is $59,422.61. Part D is a little bit trickier. It says, after how long would the car be worth nothing? So now we have N is our unknown. We know everything except n because the salvage value has to be zero when the car's worth nothing. We know the initial value and we know the rate. Now, there is a, another way mathematically to do this, but in the standard maths course and up to where you guys are up, you're going to have to use trial and error. So you're going to have to put different values for n in and see when you get the answer for zero here in the calculator. So I found that after 253.1 years, is when s will equal 0 0.000000001. So it's after 253.1 years. Now, the question doesn't ask me for the nearest month or anything like that, so I can leave it like that. Okay, I have three quick questions here for you guys to try yourself. Pause, pause the video, try it yourself, and then come back for the recommended answers. Okay, you should be done by now. Hopefully you got them all right. Till next time, take care guys.